What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, General315. I'm back with another sneaker video. This one is a Jordan 1 Mid. I really like doing these. I really, really, really like doing these. Um, these Jordan 1 Mids, they have some really good colorways. And this colorway today is one of my favorites. When I saw it, it just spoke to me. You guys already saw it based on, you know, the caption. And if you follow me on Instagram, you already saw that I was going to put it up. But this colorway, I think, is really dope. It's just a really unique shoe to have in the collection. So uh, without further ado, we're going to get into it. But make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Give me a thumbs up. Like the video. Comment down below. Make sure you follow me on IG. I'm on there all the time checking. I'm answering messages from people that have uh, questions about where to buy sneakers or, you know, who they can contact. So just hit me up. I'll get back with you. I promise you. So this shoe I got, it's a retail pair. Got it from Street Game. That's a store that, that uh, sells sneakers here in my city. And then this says Obsidian and Obsidian right here. And you can see it's a Jordan 1 that comes in the standard Jordan box. But look at these, y'all. Look at these. Look at these joints. This colorway, this colorway just speaks to me. These are the sanded purple Jordan 1 mids. Now, I saw this sanded purple, and I said, wait a minute. Just because of, you know, this is one of those just weird, just those weird colorways that kind of flies under the radar to me. Um, it's a subtle, subtle purple. It, it almost looks like it's blue, but it's not. It, it, it really is a purple, and it's just, it, it's a matte, like a matte finish. This entire shoe is that Nubuck, that synthetic Nubuck stuff. Just like the um, the yellow toes that I did in another video. It's that, it's that same synthetic Nubuck stuff. But the colorway, the way that they executed this on this colorway looks really, really dope. Because it just kind of like breaks up the blue in the shoe. This white panel is leather, just like the other ones. It's a synthetic leather. It's not the real stuff. Not the stuff like on the OG highs, but, um, you know, nonetheless, it's a, you know, it's one of those synthetic leathers. We already know about the synthetic materials on this, on the Jordan 1 mid, so I don't really need to go into too much deta detail. <clears throat> it's the same stuff. But the execution on this colorway was really, really dope to me. I think that, um... I would have liked to have different color laces for this shoe. Maybe white, maybe the purple. I think that would have been dope. Um, the Jordan the Jordan Wings logo, I, I'm cool with it being blue. It didn't need to be white. I think that's nice. It's a small little subtle hint there. The cushioning is the same as all the other Jordan 1 mids. There's an obsidian um, Jordan symbol down there. Like a jump man. There's an obsidian one down in there. And then you got your standard tag here. Um, but yeah, definitely just just one of those under the radar uh, Jordans that, that I feel like people slept on because this, you could style with these. You could do something special with these in terms of just the colorway. I wore them the other day and one of the guys is like, wow, when did those come out? And I'm like, look, I, I, I don't even know. I just saw them and I wanted them. I, I got a pair for my kids just because it was just such a dope. I mean, look at that. Look at that from the top view. That's what you're looking at when you walk at top view. People see you from the side. That's what they're looking at. You know what I mean? That's just slick right there. That's a slick, slick, slick shoe. So my first impressions when I saw that, I had to do a double take because I wasn't really sure if it was like blue or if it was purple. But then I realized that it was it was purple and I said, oh, wow, that's different. This is not like a a Greek five purple. This is more of like a, you know, so like some type of like almost brush cotton, you know, vintage type of purple color. Um, 
I think there was a a, a pack of, of Jordan One OGs that had this weird sanded color, like sanded material, like texture on the heel. And they had like a green pair, a yellow pair. There was a red one. And I believe there was a blue. I forget what the pack is called. I'll put it, I'll put it in the um in the comments. Or I'll just put it on my Instagram. I'll post a, a image of this with those. And then you guys can see what I'm talking about. I, I really do forget what it's called. But that pack was dope. I wish I would have got a pair of those. But this will suffice for now. I'll, I'll get a pair of those another time. And then I'll do a video on it. But like I said, quick video. Um, oh, I forgot to rate the shoe. If I had to rate the shoe, I mean, I'd give it a solid 8. In terms of just because I like the colorway. I'd give it like a solid 8 overall. And I like the execution of what they did with Jordan Brand, what they did with this. Um, but if, you know, rating materials, you give it like a, a six and a half, seven, because we know what the Jordan materials is like for the Jordan 1 mids. So that's going to pretty much do it for this video. Make sure you guys go and check these out in hand. They look a lot different than on a video. So make sure you guys, if you can, if you know somebody's got them, or if you can go, you know, go to the store and they're still there. Go check them out. Go feel them. You know, touch the materials. Uh, try them on. Look in the mirror. All that good stuff. I, I really, really think you guys would enjoy it. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up. I, you know, the, the, the love is appreciated and it's reciprocated. Make sure you like the video. I think I already said that. Um, comment down below if you got any questions. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. And uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Appreciate it. Later.